Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we wanted to show you guys a super quick tip in Microsoft Outlook. We're using the Mac version, although this is also a feature on the Windows version. Now before we get into that tip, if you're interested in purchasing Microsoft Office or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so here we are in Outlook, and I find this particularly useful uh, when you're kind of collaborating with several people, or maybe you have an email thread going with you know three or four different people. Uh, basically, I'm gonna compose an email here just uh, as an example. So we're gonna send this to my friend John, and we're gonna say, and we're gonna say, salesperson review. All right, so let's say that I'm having a conversation. Uh, to John, but I want to bring up somebody else in the conversation and I want them to get notified about it. Here is exactly how to do that. So John is the sales manager at Caldwell Toyota and we're just going to start the email introducing ourselves and we'll kind of get it going. So, hi John, this is Gabe, one of your newer customers at the dealership. I wanted to mention my positive experience working with your rep. And then here is where the feature happens. If we put an at symbol in and we put, we start to type somebody's name who is in our contacts, we're able to use this at mention feature, uh, which you'll be familiar with in terms of like Instagram DMs or uh, maybe Facebook or Twitter. It's a very similar feature and we can basically mention Jason in this, right? So Jay Caldwell, and then, you know, maybe we start a new line and say, he was fantastic and I had a great experience. Okay, and then I can send this off and that's pretty much it. So we can see in the two up here, it added Jason automatically uh, whenever I put in the at feature. Now I know this isn't the most practical example of this, but you can kind of imagine like if you have a thread going with three or four people and maybe you just need to talk to one person, you can use this mention thing to just save you like, you know, a quick couple of seconds and uh, make things a little bit more seamless. All right guys, that's gonna do it for this video. If you have any questions, drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in picking up Office or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. If you have any video topics that you'd like for us to cover, feel free to comment those below and we'll add it to the list. So thank you for watching and we'll see you guys next time.